Hey, what's up guys? This is Jonathan Coates and I'm just going to do a quick brief tutorial here. In this free training, I'm going to show you how to create a blog author box for your WordPress website. And this way you can increase your ranking in the search engines. Now, a lot of people don't know this, but this does have a significant impact. I actually took some notes like right before this video because I was doing some investigation and some research myself. And I was like, man, I just have to make a video about this. So I didn't get the chance to fully formulate my, my thought process on it yet, but I do have the notes. So I want to share that with you. So this is also going to be in the description here. I did some consultation with the Affiliate Marketing Samurai, who's my personal AI assistant using the GP3 model. And we were just take some notes together. You got them all compiled right here. So I just wanted to go ahead and share this with you. So how does the blog author box affects SEO? Well, there's several ways. It provides authorship attribution. So including an author box can help Google and other search engines understand who the author of a particular blog post is. This can help with authorship attribution, which can impact search engine rankings. It increases the user engagement. A well-crafted author box can increase user engagement and time spent on your website, which can improve your search engine rankings. If readers are more engaged with your content, they are more likely to stay on your site longer and interact with other pages or posts, which in turn affects your rankings in the search engines because it shows Google that people are spending time on this website, meaning that it must be a viable and credible website for your target audience. So they're likely to rank that for any given keyword. It builds authority by including information about the author, such as credentials and experience. And the author box can help establish the author as an authority on a particular topic. And it increases the credibility of your website and improve your search engine rankings. And it provides social proof. Now, the way I'm going to show you in this video, it doesn't necessarily have the social connects, but you can include them. And I'm going to show you how to do it. But by having your author box include social connects, such as your other social media websites, it allows people to click through to your social media profiles and that they see that you have a following or you have some type of engagement on those other sites and that you're active in the industry. This can help establish your website as a credible source of information. So in summary, all in all, the blog author box has a major impact on your website's SEO by providing authorship attribution, increases the user engagement, builds authority, and it provides social proof. So there's a number of different reasons why um, having a blog author box can be very beneficial for you, not just for SEO, but I wanted to highlight that in this video, but it increases your visibility of your brand. It can help drive more traffic to your website, from your social media channels to your social media channels. Um, it generates more traffic. It helps increase brand awareness. This is just a lot of different reasons. So I'm going to show you just how easy it is. It's not that difficult. If you're on your main WordPress dashboard, I'm going to show you how to do that. So it looks like Chrome is trying to implement some of Edge's, Edge's browser capabilities because that does give them the competitive edge, no pun intended. But uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So this is the blog author box here, and I actually have a blog author box template for you in the resource section uh, below. All you got to do is just click on it. It's going to take you directly to the Google Docs. You don't have to put your email in or opt in or anything like that. But basically, it's just a template for the health and fitness industry, but you can interchange this with any other, other evergreen markets such as wealth and relationships. You want to take this time to highlight your expertise. So I'm going to show you what this template is all about, and then I'm going to show you how to implement it. But this is how it looks underneath your blog post. So any blog post that they land on, if they're reading it at the very end of it, they're going to see this here. So I'm going to have Yours look just like this. But first, this is what the template says. Hi there, my name is your name, and I am passionate about all things health and fitness. Again, this is just a template. You can change this to finance and wealth. You can change this to relationships, saving your marriage, getting your ex back, etc. Whatever your niche is, I have always been interested in living a healthy lifestyle and helping others do the same. I received a degree slash certification in health and fitness related field. Now you don't have to have an education or a degree in order to highlight your expertise. You can just share your experience here. You can just say, hey, I've been in the industry for however many long years. And then you can say in my free time, you can find me at the gym, trying out new healthy recipes or going for a run outdoors. And you can just share what you're into and just try to make sure that it's relevant and related to the actual niche. I am excited to share my knowledge and experience with you through my writing on my website we can also say i am excited to share my knowledge and experience with you feel free to follow me on my social connection you can just put facebook here or instagram so this is how it looks on the health and fitness website i'm going to show you how it looks on the modern keto plan website just because i haven't done it over here all i got to do on this main dashboard here on the left hand side where it says users i click on all users and once we get to this page we're going to see our user now what we want to do is we just want to click on edit 
and this is where we actually create the author box so the first thing that we want to do is we want to put our first name so i'm just going to put jonathan and then i'm going to put my last name here and then you can have your nickname so i just put john coast 89 in regards to my nickname and then here is where you want to actually select what you want them to display your name as so it can be your nickname it can be your first name it can be your last name or it can be your first and last name i recommend that it's not your nickname and it's your first name or your first and last name because it just adds that level of professionalism there and then also you can put your email it's not really uh, necessary in regards to the actual blog author box but in order to save this information you do have to have that so right now we got a first and our last name we've got our, our a display name and here is actually where you put your biographical info so i'm just going to go ahead and copy this what you can do is you can use ai assistance so you can go to chat gpt or any of the gpt3 models and they just have them go hey rewrite this for such and such industry rewrite this for my niche rewrite this for the relationship market rewrite this for underwater basket weaving we, you know whatever niche you're in just say hey we just copy and paste that and give it to them and say hey rewrite this and they'll they'll replace all the words with something that's relevant to that industry i've, I've actually tried that before it's, it's pretty interesting but i'm just going to leave this as is i'm i'm, I'm not going to um, fill in the blanks you kind of get the idea so once you put the information in there and you have it filled out in accordance to how you want it to look, you just what you want to do is you want to up, go ahead and click update profile real quick just to save it. And then what we want to do is we just want to scroll back down. And then right here is where you can change your profile picture. Now, if you click on this, it's going to redirect you to a website called gravitar.com. And here is actually where you can just sign in using your WordPress credentials and it'll give you the opportunity to change your profile picture. And that's going to populate across all of the different websites. So let me just show you real quick what it looks like. So let's go for this one right here, 14 day done for you keto. And as you can see, I got the blog off the box right at the bottom. Now, if you don't see it, all you gotta do is just click on clear OP3 cache and then click on refresh. And then you should see it come up. If not, then, then go ahead and clear the cache on your internet browser and you should see it pop up. It's no issue there. I just realized that I didn't show you how to add the social connect. So let me just show you how to do that real quick before I end this video. So if we were to go back, just go back to dashboard and then click on users. Let's go back to edit. So if you want to add a link, what you can do is you can actually just take that URL and then you can put it right here, or you can just put the actual URL for wherever you want to go. And if you don't want it to be some long drawn out URL, like a, like a, you know, like a 28 letter URL like this, you can just go to bit.ly and I'll go ahead and put that in the description as well, but it's just a URL shortener. Um, you just take your URL, like the link to your profile and put it in that URL shortener and you can just put it in here. That way it's clickable when people, um, actually go or on your your actual website so if they were to go to your blog post and then scroll down they'll be able to click on it right here or wherever you have it placed all right so yeah that's pretty much it and then once you have that saved you just click on update profile and then everything should be configured correctly for you all right that's pretty much it i hope you enjoyed this video if you like content like this then i highly recommend that you check out my website jonathancoast.com i talk about everything when it comes to generating traffic and increasing sales and also be sure to take a look at the tools and the resources below i have this blog author box template as well as bit.ly the url shortener and with that said i will see you in the next video see you there